I am currently booted into a live CD. Uh, this distribution I'm booted into is called Slit As, I believe is how you pronounce it. It's French. Um, they got their little logo is a spider there. Uh, what I like about this distribution is that it is only 39 megabytes in size and it comes with a full desktop and plenty of applications are available for it. And the reason I'm in this is I'm going to show you how to use the DD command, which is a command that uh, will create images of hard drives and partitions uh, that you can either restore to other partitions or hard drives or just use as uh, backups. And I'm going to show you how to use this command to install any version of Linux you want without having to burn a CD. Most newer computers, you can boot, install Linux to a flash drive boot from that USB device, but if you're working with an older machine, uh, you probably won't be able to do that, and you may not want to burn a CD, but if you already have a live CD, which most of us do have handy, uh, you can use this technique to install another version of Linux, not just the one that you have the live CD of. So I just finished downloading using wget, although you could use your browser like Firefox, download uh, an image of Debian. It's a net image uh, for a net install. So it's only 16 megabytes. I'll have the link in the description for it. So I use wget to download that. Now, as root, I'm going to use the dd command to install that image to a hard drive. Uh, make sure the hard drive is not mounted. If you type mount, it will show you all mounted uh, partitions and I know that my device is device uh, HDA and I don't see that there so I know it's not mounted and I'm just going to type DD IF equals and then the name of the image file which is just in this case Debian dot IMG and now I go OF and the device I want to install to which is DEV HDA. I don't want to, in this case, install it to a partition. I want to copy the image straight to the device itself. So I do that. It's only a 16 megabyte uh, image. It's already done. Now, if I log out and reboot, and I reboot to the hard drive, uh, it will actually start the net install of Debian. Uh, so I didn't have to burn any CDs other than the live CD that I already have. And, uh, and the net install of Debian, you can also get a net install of Ubuntu or most distributions. What it will do is it's a small file and it will actually install off the internet instead of off the CD, uh, which makes it real easy because you get the newest stuff and you don't have to uh, uh, update everything after you do an install and usually small files for downloading. So there you go. Um, running the net install from the hard drive. Uh, when you go through this, you're going to uh, format and partition the hard drive, it will actually install over the installation image we just put there. So that's how you can install any distribution of Linux without having to download and burn that CD in particular. So I hope that was helpful and I'll do more on DD soon.